The Icon School of Medicine in Mount Sinai is not just a uh, place to go to work for me. I was born here, my family was born here, and I feel very much a kinship to, to being here and, and don't feel like I come to work every day. I feel I just come to a second home. As a child, I used to come to Mount Sinai where my father worked in the microbiology lab for over 46 years. I'd run around the halls and, and the different labs and, and be wide-eyed and you know, surprised by uh, what was being done there. Like everything else in life, uh, there are things that shape the way that you become. The I and icon speaks for the fact that it's for individuals and for the ability to foster individuals and, and really bring and make the best physician, surgeon, researcher out of you. We trained at a time when no one knew what robotic surgery really was over 20 years ago. And I remember very clearly a, a day going to sort of a seminar and there were maybe four or five of us in the room learning about robotic surgery. People were just baffled by the fact that we could send patients home within 24, 48 hours, as opposed to keeping in the hospital five to seven days, which was always the, the way that it was done for, you know, since the dawn of surgery. I performed the very first robotic nephrectomy here at Mount Sinai, and that's uh, removal of a diseased kidney. We're doing things that people never dreamed we could possibly do. This is just a, in a whole new era of techniques of how we do procedures and really make a difference in people's lives. The thing that I'm most grateful for from the Icon School of Medicine at Mount Sinai is the fact that it gave me a chance to grow and it gave me a chance to become the person that I am today. To stay alive and flourish 50 years later is a, is a feat in and of itself. Happy 50th anniversary to the Icon School of Medicine at Mount Sinai. I'm very happy and very proud to be part of that.